Hello, 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 and welcome back to some more bro -tato. We're gonna just jump right into another run. I think I know who I want to do a run as, and it's the Engineer. Someone that I've been talking about for a while. As you can see, I've got a lot more characters unlocked because I've been testing things. And I'm not gonna lie, I just enjoy it. Um, we're not gonna do new enemies, we're just gonna stick to Danger Zero for now. And let's get going. So the engineer gets these wrenches, and for every wrench I have, it spawns a turret. So most of the plan is just surviving and yet letting the turrets do the killing. Um, so basically anything that I guess can give us pickup range, uh, maybe some dodge chance. That's what we're about. Uh, let's get... Mm, let's re-roll. Let's get some luck going, I think. That might be quite good. A second wrench, some fertilizer for sure, and the duct tape will lock. Perfect. I've been learning more about the game. I understand harvesting a bit better now in the fact that harvesting is you get resources at the end of the level based on your harvesting, which I didn't fully understand previously. But now I understand it. And it makes way more sense, and it means harvesting is very valuable. Um, oh yes, get the box. Lovely. Right at the last second. What is this? Uh, some three max HP, but start with one at the start of the round. We don't have any HP regen. Let's just recycle that. Uh, engineering, too. So for every engineering that we have, it does more damage. So engineering here increases the power of your structures. Other primary stats don't affect structures, but secondary stats do. Piercing, mounting, explosion size. It's fairly, fairly understandable, I think. Lovely. Another wrench and a level 2 wrench. Perfect. Uh, the rest of this is pointless. So we're basically just trying to build up as many turrets as possible, and we're allowing them to do the killing. So we just kind of want to spend our days running round, picking up what they kills drops, and uh, looking for trees. Trees are prizes, prizes are fun, and um, that's pretty much it really for this build. It's kind of a bit of a, it's a little bit of a lazy man's build, but I like it because I'm an engineer in real life. <laughs> so I have to, have to represent in the game as well. Uh, okay, let's just get the harvesting uh, and let's get some more engineering. More engineering, more good. We'll grab that. Uh, none of this looks great for us, but another wrench will do us quite nicely. Uh, and this might be quite nice for more enemies. Uh, more enemies is just more killing, more killing, more good. You get the you get the gist of it now, I think. So now we've got, oh, right, okay, this is what I need to explain. So this turret here is an incendiary turret and it, it shoots fire. Um, and the fire turret is there because I've got a level two uh, crowbar now, or wrench now. So basically as you level up your wrenches, you get different turrets as well. Um, so level two is incendiary, level three is uh, laser, I think maybe? Level four is explosive. So if we could get all explosive turrets, we'd be living a sweet life. Um, right, let's get the harvesting going. Let's get another wrench in there. Let's get this for more enemies. None of this looks good. That looks good to me. Uh, none of that. So we've got two level twos now. So that'll spawn two flame turrets. And look at us. We're just a, a man full of wrenches. You can get screwdrivers as well, which spawn mines. Um, they are pretty good, to be fair, but I like the wrenches. The damage they put out is nice, um, because we could buff our melee damage and do more damage with the wrenches. It's not really what I use this build for, it's not what I'm about sort of thing, but it's always an option to be able to, um, kill things with the wrenches ourselves if things get a little too close. But we can mostly, with six of them, we anything that gets close to us does get kind of clobbered. Uh, which is pretty sweet. Lovely. Okay. Uh, recycle the cake. Let's get... Oh, we have to take engineering every time. Even though it's a big boost to harvesting, we have to take the engineering. And let's take the dodge chance. Oh, 
look at this. This is a dream. So we combine these two and we buy this and then we get the pickup range and we'll save that for the more enemies as well. Perfect, so now we get a level three turret, which is the laser turret. Yeah, yeah, I was right, okay. And then once we can get a level four, oh, life becomes good. We get some buffs for explosions. We'll be living sweet. And we don't have to do that much. I'm not too scared with this wave because again, as long as I stand near these guys, they do the work for me. So like, if I ever get scared, I just run back to home basically. <laughs> and home keeps me safe. And with the slightly increased pickup range, it means I, I don't have to venture as far to grab all the drops, which is pretty sweet. So I can kind of hang around here and make sure I get everything, every round sort of thing. Like we only missed five drops that round. Pretty good. Oh, four engineering increase. Yes, please. We'll take that for that. Oh, more engineering. We'll take that. Let's give it a reroll. Another wrench. Perfect. Get ourselves a level up there. Uh, explosive damage. Let's take that. Let's lock this for more engineering and armor. And let's jump back in. So now most of our turrets are flame turrets. Only one level one left, which is pretty good. Buying the explosive damage is, it does nothing for us right now, but it's an investment into future damage. Um, and I hopefully think that will pay off once we get some explosive turrets. Because the explosive turrets, obviously the benefit is it's AOE damage. So we're hitting more than one boy, which is always what we want. Ooh, another tree. Remember, that's pretty much all we have to do as the engineer, is hunt for the trees, break them to hopefully get some loot. Extra loot. Nothing there, that's fine. Break the trees, pick up the stuff. Like, look at all of that that was just left there because the turrets are just killing while I'm running around like a fool. Ooh, a garden. That's quite good, actually. Spawns fruit every 15 seconds. Some more engineering. Love that. Um... We'll take the... We'll take the base damage, I think. Um, we'll take the duct tape. Uh, we could take the tractor, actually. Let's do that. Uh, and then a wrench. And now all of our stuff is level two. This is the screwdriver. So spawns landmines every 12 seconds. I just don't find that that quick. Um, we can take that next turn. And let's go. Look at our little character. He looks so dumb. Just a little egg boy. Yeah, we do need to be a bit more careful in this round. Because once the big guys start spawning, we are... We'll take a lot more damage if we're because the, the turrets can't kill them quick enough yet. Uh, we need to boost our engineering to be able to kill them faster. But that's fine. As long as we just keep circling and eating fruit from the garden, we live pretty good. Oh, and we dodged that one. We didn't dodge that one. Oh my god. Oh, he hit like a ton of bricks. Give me some fruit. Yes, please. Fruit, please. Fruit, please. Oh my god. This one's a bit of a hectic round, actually. The big boys do make it a little bit more difficult, as I said, because, again, the turrets just... I don't think the flame turrets are that great, but I don't have the space necessarily to keep upgrading to the lasers yet, and the lasers are much better. Uh, perfect. Engineering again. Let's then combine two of these, take another wrench. Uh, we could take this. What's our armor at? Two. I'd rather, I mean, no. Let's not take that. Uh, explosive damage. Again, investment into the future. Not great right now. Medical turret will do us good because it's actually benefited from the extra engineering that we have. Um, a regular turret. We can always just buy those. And a book for more engineering. Perfect. Reroll one more time. That is wonderful. And we can get some mines as well. And let's let's lock in the scar as well. Um, perfect. So now we've got two laser turrets and more turrets because we bought them just as separate things and a healing turret. Slowly we're taking over the world with all of our tech. This is the engineer's life right here. Look at us go. Just living, living by the, the technology. Live by the technology, die by the technology. We won't die though. We won't die. Although if I leave 
too far away, as you see. Life gets a little bit scarier out in the, uh, the wastelands where my turrets don't live. The nice thing is they do all spawn really close to each other, which makes life a little bit easier. Because if they all spawned different corners of the map, I'd have no safe space. But my safe space is just over here. Nice and nice and cheeky and home. We do have to dodge, obviously, the big boys still, because they will ruin my life. But go for the tree. Four. Come on. Ah, oh, nothing in the tree. That's fine. Uh, more harvesting. I'll take that. Our melee damage is minus one. Not the worst. Harvesting. Let's take the dodge chance, I think. And then we take the wrench. That's good. We take the wrench. That's good. Oh, and this and this. And a free reroll because we had everything purchased. Uh, what's our armor like? We could take that for some more resources coming in. Perfect. We take that. Attacks have a chance to deal burn. I think we will take that, but we're going to combine these first by this. We'll lock that for now, and let's go. So now everything is a laser turret, basically. I think, besides one. And we purchased one anyway, remember? So lasers do a lot of damage, and the more engineering, obviously, we can get, the more damage we'll do, which is wonderbar. I think we could do with some uh, health regen, though. I, I do keep seeing that the only way we're regening is from eating, which is fine, obviously, but if we get in a tricky situation and there's no food on the ground or the healing turret isn't healing us fast enough, it could get a bit sketchy. But I am prioritizing other stats right now because the stronger we can get, the less we have to heal. <laughs> it's a little bit of a, a little bit of a kind of trade-off that we're trying to work into right now. Nope, that wasn't worth it. Empty tree. You just have to take the leap sometimes. There's a there's a really good perk that we can get where it's every time you destroy a tree, it spawns a turret, which would be pretty sweet for us. Um, but again, that requires us finding that perk. Oh, pickup range. Yes, give me. Uh, let's actually take a huge amount of range. Oh, perfect. And then a huge amount of engineering. We could take another garden. And let's take the sausage. Uh, let's have a look-see here. What's our speed at? Is it zero? Let's not take anything from there. Nothing from there. There's a wrench. Perfect. Oh, not any good-looking drops right now. Oh, this isn't too bad. Let's take that. Let's take another garden. We'll have three gardens going. We're a little... Look at how many blue things spawn at the start of the round now. Got such a little like dome of safety. So much food spawning, so much like just everything. It's good. I do love this character. It's actually quite a fun way to make a build. I don't think I've won with this character yet. I did a bit of testing. I got to the final wave but died. Um, because uh, ego. That's the only problem with this character is you develop an ego of safety very quickly because you feel pretty invincible as long as you stand near your boys. But once you leave the safety of the boys, life is scary. This is like a weird sort of uh, analogy for being a child and leaving home. Home is home is safe. Life is scary. <laughs> Legitimately. Ah, oh, that tree spawned in... <clears throat> my god. I'm losing my voice. Too much content being generated. Uh, how will I survive? Um... Recycle. Oh, five more engineering. Have to take that. Um, this is not worth it right now. We're already halfway through. Uh, this is not great, but we will take it for the free roll. There we go. We do that. Uh... Okay, we can combine two of these to get our first level four. Now the explosive damage will start to pay off. Um, we could take a level four screwdriver as well next round. Might not be the worst thing. Trees die on one hit. Yeah, let's do that. We'll take the level four screwdriver next round. Um, just so that we have it. There's the explosive turret though. Firing away. This little green one over here. So as long as we can start to get more of those, we'll be looking pretty good. 
I don't think they fire as fast, but the AoE pretty much makes up for it because as long as things are near-ish, covers covers that sort of area pretty nicely. Ooh, okay. Yeah, a couple big boys spawned on me there. Uh, but again, I think the turrets have the damage to deal with them now, which is good. They just need to be within range of the turrets, which is why, again, I do have to kind of stay here as well to make sure that the turrets are actually in range of everything. Otherwise, we have a little bit of an issue with uh, things not dying quick enough. And if I bring too many things to the turrets, I die. <laughs> oh, I don't think we're getting this in time. Oh, it's one hit, isn't it? Yeah, we did. Not too bad. Uh, let's take the harvesting, more stuff at the end of wave. Let's combine two of you. Let's buy you more fruit. Sure. Reroll for free. Uh, uh, Reroll. Nothing good looking. Nothing great. There's another wrench. We can lock that for now. We can lock that for now. One max HP for every 100 mineral uh, materials you have. Mm, pointless. But you can have three of those, so actually that could get quite nutty if you could find three of them. Uh, so now we should be spawning loads of mines because we've got the level 4 screwdriver. So you see a lot more explosions around. We can trigger mines, but they don't damage us, which is fine. Um, I don't mind. It's like a little bit of a waste, but at the same time, like, come on, it's not the worst. The turrets also do shoot the trees, which is good. So, because at the end of a wave, if there's a box on the floor, it will still give it to us. So as long as the trees get shot by the um, turrets, it's not the end of the world. Um, we just need to make sure the trees are all dead at the end of the wave, or else we end up missing out on good, good loot. They're following me pretty heavily. <laughs> please stop. Please stop chasing me, sir. I refuse to see you right now. Oh my god. So much fruit on the floor from all of our trees. <laughs> all of our little gardens. Perfect. Um, I think now might be the time to take that HP regen. Oh, four heart. Yes, love it. So now we combine two of you, and we buy you, and we buy you. So now we're, we're looking pretty good on getting all of our wrenches to level four. More trees spawn. What's that? We could take this for the damage. Let's take the bait. Oh, perfect, another wrench. That's exactly what we need. Uh, let's take the attack speed. Uh, the bag might be good. And let's just go. So now we've got three level four turrets. So these big enemies spawn because of the bait. But that's fine. Pretty much get dealt with by themselves now. There's a tree over here. Nada. More trees, more trees, give me the loot, please. That's a little song. More trees, more trees, give me the loot, please. Always forget I have one hand free. I do look like an idiot, though. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't help that. Because most of the time it is because I am, in fact, an idiot. <laughs> but some of the times... No, 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 all the time it's because I'm an idiot, in fact the unfortunate truth. I am a large fool. Uh, we're just cleaning house now though. We need to make sure we're getting as much minerals as possible every round so we can buy as many things as we need. How much are we getting at the end of the round from harvesting now? A fair bit, you know, about 100. More pickup range, love that. Uh, let's take the luck. Boost our luck a little bit. Let's get that. Let's get the knockback. Let's get more experience gain. Reroll. Um, armor. We've got one armor right now. Let's not sacrifice that. Uh, more trees. Sure, I'll take more trees. Uh, we could take the 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 soap. Schmoop. Sh we take the schmoop. Here we go. Look at all the blue that spawns. We're a bigger dominating force than the enemies now. Tree die. More trees, more good. Although, to be fair, I'm hoping our luck will start to give us more drops from the trees. Because we're not getting that many drops right now. Um, 
And while they're like, they're not always that great, it's either you get money for recycling them or they are sometimes good. Like the pickup range does us real good. Like we're picking up things from a, a decent bit away now. Um, I don't think the pickup range is that great to start with, to be fair, which is the problem. Like most characters, I don't even know if any have like a boost to pickup range. Um, but like, yeah, the to start with, you really don't pick up from far away. Safety, safety. Ooh, I, I've started complaining though, and that is two drops straight away. I presume the turrets killed a tree to get one drop. Man, we got we got scared there though. Ooh, a lot of money though. Um, would take the luck. Uh, minus dodge chance. Yeah, we can take that as well. Uh, harvesting, sure. We'll, we'll grab a bit more harvesting. Uh, that's some engineering. We'll take that. We'll take the landmines. Um, 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 it's getting a little dark in my room, but I think you guys can still see me okay. Uh, give me something good, though. Uh, projectiles pierce through one additional enemy. I'm pretty sure piercing counts, right? Piercing does count, yeah. Minus piercing damage, minus damage. Nothing great. God, nothing great at all. Um... Minus one range damage. What's our range damage at? Uh, zero now, anyway. We can take that. Here you go. One engineering for every elemental damage. We don't have any elemental damage right now, but we'll take it. Um, and we can start to aim for elemental damage as well. I don't know. I, literally, we got nothing good from that wave at all. Uh, which sucks a little bit. But it's fine. Oh. <laughs> I think that's, that has to be a bug. That's happened to me a couple times where, like, they, even though I've got pickup range big enough at this point, because it's outside of the map, it just won't give it to me, which sucks. Because boxes are good. Oh, it might give it to me at the end of the wave, though, because it might get picked up at the end of the wave. Ooh, keep an eye on that. We'll keep an eye on that. If at the end of the wave we've got two boxes currently... Ho, ho, ho! Oh my god, we just ate a huge amount of food to survive there. That was a bit nuts. Um, tree, nothing. They're like little um, little mystery boxes, though. You're just waiting to see if you'll get anything good. Okay. Did we get two? We did get two. Okay, so that's fine. Uh, engineering, we'll take. Uh, we'll take that, sure. None of that looks great. Harvesting, sure. Landmines, yes. Engineering, yes. Um, bag, knockback, nothing great. I mean, I'm looking. You know what I'm looking for. I'm looking for another wrench. Uh, okay, so incendiary turret. That's fine. Cog. That's fine. We can lock a garden in. But again, not the best round of buying. Give me the good stuff. We've even not like we're not even negative on luck. We're just getting unlucky with our um, our choices of stuff. I think they're just avoiding giving me wrenches. They don't want me to have. Oh my god, no! What's hitting me that hard? Is it these boys? I think it is. We're doing no damage. We really have to rely on turrets, uh, which is fine because that was the plan. But we really like. We do nothing at this wave anymore. We are just a carrier for the turrets, basically. Like we pick up the stuff for the turrets and that's it. We don't even necessarily have to leave, I don't think. Like We could probably stand pretty much still and still do pretty... Mm, I don't know about that, actually. Can we stand here? Yeah, I mean, we could stand still. We need the stuff, though, is the problem. Armor, dodge, man, that's pretty good. We'll take that. Um, let's boost our luck again. Let's take the garden. Reroll. Give me something good! Engineering, sure. Uh, there we go, this is good. Okay, right. So, this is really good. Two engineering. Uh, killing a tree spawns a turret, great. This is good. 
because this will lure more of the creatures that have boxes. Sure. This we need next round. Okay. That's kind of made up for it. We've got some good stuff there. We've got another another farm as well, which is cute. <laughs> we're just playing farming sim now. We're farming the enemies for their drops. We're, we're just farming sim away. Looking for boxes. Having a great time running around. Dodging all the attacks. Love it. Oh, there's a there's a box for us. Perfecto. They just get delivered. It's like Amazon. They're like they're like Amazon workers. They just bring me boxes. I want to see the little menaces though that have the boxes on them. There's little green guys that run around with boxes on their back, and that's what we bought the bait for. There he was. Oh, I just I killed him so quickly to be fair. And I say I the turrets really just focus fired on that boy. Uh, we got two boxes so far this wave. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Get any more? Any more for any more? No? Okay, that's fine. We're pretty consistent on, um... We could take that, right? Yeah, we could take that. Melee damage, max HP range. We'd lose a bit of range. Sorry, one second. Alexa, bedroom light's on. Okay. Oh, there you go. You can see me a bit better. Um, recycle that, I think. Let's take more luck. Right, so let's combine these, grab another wrench, reroll. Um, oh, Thunder Sword. It is pretty cool, but it's not what we need. Uh, none of this is what we need. A wrench level two. Recycle this, buy this, that's fine. Uh, this is kind of pointless now, so late in the game. Medical turret, we can definitely take a second one of those. Uh... I mean, that's just overall good. And that's kind of it. So we might lock that in. But otherwise, we need screwdriver uh, wrenches. More wrenches. More wrenches, more good. Okay, come on. Let's just survive. That's all we got to do. To be fair, this is the second to last wave, actually. After this, it's over. We might win. We're looking pretty good so far. We are kind of like, we're surviving. There's times where we're not surviving, but for the boss, I will literally just stick in the middle. Right now, I'm running around because I want more money to be able to buy more stuff. But once the boss is here, I don't need stuff. I just need to live. Living. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Back to the healing, please. Ooh. <laughs> I got a little scary, didn't it? I got a little bit scary. They really do just uh, swarm at certain points, and it gets a little bit crazy, but that's fine. This is our last wave to buy stuff in, so let's make sure we get as much money as possible. Okay, 800 is pretty good. Your speed is capped at its current value. Well, that's fine because this will give us loads of engineering, HP regen, and range, and we're going into the final round. Uh, we could take dodge. And we could take engineering. We're going full in. We're going full in. Um, when an enemy dies, I just don't think it's that great. Reroll. Spawns a little guy that slowly shoots 10 piercing lightning projectiles around him for 106 each. Oh, that's pretty good, actually. We'll take Tyler. Tyler, my boy! Uh, engineering, Cooper, oh, bought that in the wrong order, that's fine. Another turret. Okay, it's getting good now. We don't need pickup range anymore. Um, let's re-roll. <sighs> that's a shame, that's a real shame. We can take more engineering though. Uh, and I think this is it. This is where we're going in. How much engineering do we have? 100 engineering. Is that capped or did we just hit around 100? Don't know. But either way, spawn in my home. Shoot that alien boy. Shoot him. Shoot him. Bring him down. <laughs> We're doing it, though. We're just staying away. We're doing it. We're just going to dodge his little, like, thing. Oh, we dodged it there, technically. Um, we took some damage there. That's fine. We dodged it there, I think. Oh, we didn't dodge it there. That's fine, though. He's like half health now. 
We just need to stay away from him and let everything else work, basically. Okay, that's fine. Make sure we just go in to have some food. Dodge. Yes, it's happening. It's happening. Just bait him down here somewhere. Through all the enemies. Oh, that was bad, but it's fine. We have enough health, I think, on the floor in general to survive most hits. Oh, we got a box. Winner run as the engineer. Let's have a look at these stats. Oh, we got we unlocked something. The robot arm. Six armor, six engineering. Oh, that's pretty good, you know. We were only negative on crit chance, range damage, and melee damage. Otherwise, we were pretty tanked up on everything else. 237 harvesting is nuts. Um, but yeah, so we did it. Thank you very much for watching this run, and I will see you guys in the next one. <laughs> Don't know what this is. Thank you very much. Oh wow, you've actually made it this far. Okay, um, three things. Um, don't forget to maybe watch another video. I don't know which side I'm on. These ones, this or this, there's a box with a video. Um, consider subscribing and maybe like the video. Leave a comment, I'll, I'll say hello. Anything, go, go wild.